Isimili, Isimili Diofo, Isimili Diakatakofo, SDK. Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Summer. Well, I want to share this, um, you know, you Leduche, you know recently he made the post and he actually pointed a finger at his auntie, um, the Rita Edoche. So Rita Edoche, for those that don't know, well, is his auntie because he's the, um, she was married to um, her, his uncle, okay? Now, let me read to you guys what he said and then her reply that she gave him, okay? Then he says, he said, it, he said, what did what they did to mobad is what they what they've been doing to me in the uh, on the internet for over one year how many nollywood people have come out to say enough and uh, you are all waiting for me to die so you can post my picture and write your nonsense justice for you know dot 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 uh natonda if i start laughing and people say i'm laughing you see when something is funny i'm not laughing at him i'm laughing at what he wrote like not laughing at because it's funny, if that makes sense. Then he says, now thank okay, let me try not to laugh. Super say it's not professional to laugh. Okay, say, now thought that go fire all of Una. Okay, then I said, I lost my son in the midst of unbearable pain. Them say Nami killed my son. How many of Una come out to fight for justice? Even my own auntie, this is where he referred to her, has not called me on the phone for one day to ask me what happened. Um Instead, she they use me draw traffic for her page. That is what he accused her of doing. That basically she is using him to uh, chase clout. And then she replied to him, and this is what she said. So she screenshot that part where he said, even my auntie, da da da. That's the part she screenshot and she shared it. And he said, and she said, this particular line made tears drip. She put a lot of uh, crying emojis uh, from my eyes, especially the word my own. Because said, even my own auntie, right? He now, she now said, uh, she now wrote it there and said, even my own auntie has not called me on phone for one day to ask me what happened. She put it in bracket. And then she said, good a thing, you still regard me as your auntie. But I will not say anything on this for now. She now said, also saying that I am using your name uh, and matter as a traffic medium on my page how hilarious can this be she put a lot of laughing emojis with question marks and she said but i will still not say anything because i am happy you know me too well then she wrote my dear son you are not the subject matter and that is the reason i don't talk about you because i know you are not yourself anymore so she feels like so people feel like he has been kaya matad Kayamata, they used to do on him that this you that is speaking is not the real you. That's what she's saying there. Okay, she's anymore. She said, but but you will surely get back to used to be. Whether drama devil, that's what she calls Judy in bracket Judy Austin, likes it or not, there are no doubts you are being caged slash bottled by your so-called wife whom you picked, not knowing when and how you did. The subject matter is. The so-called wife will woke up one morning to hear you picked and until she releases you, she will still remain my subject matter. And the sooner she opens this bottle and break it into pieces so you can freely return to your, uh, I think meant to say humble, humble abode, better for we all in entirety. But before, uh, this page does not and will never support any form of violence. Dalu, Dalu is thank you. As always, I'm going to give my take on it. You guys can give your take on it in the comment section. Me, although some people say they believe it's juju, they believe it. me. I don't know about the juju aspect, but I always say it. A man and even a woman is free to marry whoever they want to marry. This is how I feel about it. I know in Nigerian culture they say marriage is between uh, two families, not between two people. It's between two families. So if your family did not follow you to go and pick you to go and marry. Okay, you found the wife and say, I want to marry this lady. And there's a, you know, there's that initial thing where the family goes and they meet the other family and ask for her hand in marriage. And then all of that, they do the traditional and all of those things. Don't forget, there was something Peter Duche said. When they were asking him about May and Duche, and he said people do not know how much he loves her, how much he loves her. And he said, and I, apparently uh, him and the girl, uh, the uh, May and Duche's father were friends. And he said something. 
that he said it in a like in, like a parable not a parable but he said it in a way that there's a hidden message in it he said when i went when when we went or when i went to her village to go marry her don't forget that in that same sentence he said that they did not follow the son to go and marry judy but then he now emphasized about when they went to go and marry me that from what i understand is that the wife that i follow my picky marry is me i didn't join in marrying this uh, um judy and don't forget that after that speech after that the post she had of him on her page she removed all of them after that speech i just don't let me double check to be sure and uh, yeah but i think she removed all the previous posts she had about him she removed it from them she had posts where vid pictures where she was sitting side by side by him coming back to you let me tell you guys where i've always made it clear where i had an issue is if a man don't want to marry again you can leave your wife and go to another wife trying to almost enforce polygamy i personally was not a fan of that behavior that is one another aspect is okay you it has happened the way it happened as a man as a grown man you don't use your family for petty drama as if you are some teenagers children that do not understand life those are the areas i have problem with me i have no problem me i'll keep saying it too i never blame judy i don't blame her because it's a man that chooses to go and marry somebody else that chooses to leave his marriage and me i blame where i blame her is when she puts her mouth and addresses the maze son she ha i feel like she shouldn't have done that she shouldn't have even spoken about the son as well and get herself in like the areas as well where she does things that's almost like pepe them thing that she's doing basically who won't pepe apart from pepe the wife that you married her uh, married her husband i feel like that was wrong respect that woman let her face her lane she has never addressed judy as far as i know she has never the may has not come to do any kind of drama at all i believe my opinion it was wrong for uh, uh, judy to now come and do all this uh, rub in your face kind of a thing because when you come and you're praising this man and you're doing basically the message is this whether you like it or not i've taken your husband that's what it sounds like those are the areas me I fought her. And then speaking about the Kambili and say uh, she lost a uh, man lost. You shouldn't have left the man to address his family problem. And may Judy, I mean you, to think a grown man, you remember we saw Kuni Meta, Dimpa, that's Igbo language, a fully grown man will come out and use his family issues as a petty drama. That was when he dropped himself to the ground, in my opinion. But for going by what Rita has uh, written, she's basically saying that she has no issue with you. She has issues with Judy. So now Judy, the, she's dealing with Judy. As far as, that's what she started to explain. It is Judy she's dealing with, not uh, you. You. She feels say his eyes are not uh, yet uh, clear. So uh, maybe when they succeed in chasing the, uh, uh, what's it called, Judy away, then maybe his eyes will be clear. So that's what she has, uh, uh, you know, uh, expressed there. Maybe when he's thinking he lost her son, she should have called. She may feel like, what am I calling him for? He's not his normal self. Because even him, he was not acting like he's normal. Let's be honest. A man that lost his son, a few weeks later, came out and continued as if nothing happened. Not only that he continued, but he was now doing drama. But people are like, is this man grieving or is not grieving? You can't tell people how to grieve, oh, but you can't tell people how to view your grieving. That's the thing again. People are crit critiquing it, analyzing it. Ah, now wow. Now this man, he won't grieve in as he get to. So he was not even looking like someone that needed sympathy. You understand? He didn't even look like someone that needed consoling. Viewers, some viewers needed consoling from what we see oh, more than even him that is the father of the, the child. So you won't be surprised people don't call you and say, how are you? When they feel like, ah, he's okay. Because he came out and looked okay. And came out and dancing with the other woman. A man that just lost his child is coming out and dancing with the other woman that has not lost a child. And I can bet you that if it was Judy that lost a child, God forbid, I do not believe that she would have been ready for a dance. You know that, you know what I mean? So these are the issues that this is, these are the problems. And I keep saying it, this whole thing is in Jules, is in, is in Jules' hands. It's in his hands. 
the, whenever I create drama, people come and analyze the drama. It's what you put out the internet will be. This marriage thing can be could have been private, whatever, whatever. They're doing all this dance and she's praising him and he's doing like this. People are not pleased with what they see. And it's the most natural thing people for, for people to on this social media to express their displeasure. Because just the same way they will say, Wow, uh, wow, look at if somebody if it, if somebody did something that people want to comment, wow. They comment it when somebody does something the day he will post something that people want to comment of course they will comment it and say well in the past don't forget with this man when he posted him and his daughter and said daughter went into college people were uni university people were like, oh wow you have raised a grown child people used to hail him in those days but when they now post that what people don't like people are not on or people are not hailing him for it that is the power of the social media Abi, I don't know. This is my opinion about it. As always, whatever your opinions are, please uh, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. And forget if you have not given the thumbs up uh, to the video, I have not clicked the like. Uh, thumbs up for the video. Don't forget to do that now. Thank you for watching. Until the next time, guys. Bye bye. Bye.